Well, it's a challenging side effect of the coronavirus that we still don't know a lot about. But researchers have new insight into why COVID-19 impacts our sense of smell. Medical reporter Liz Bonus explains. So we collected the olfactory bulb from 23 deceased COVID patients, as well as 14 control individuals negative for COVID. What they found out about our loss of smell has not been the focus of previous research. In a study just released in JAMA Neurology, Dr. Cheng Ying Ho, Associate Professor of Pathology at Johns Hopkins University School of Medicine, told me her team discovered it appears it's not the SARS-CoV-2 virus itself that impacts the loss of smell, but rather the inflammation that results from it. So this tells us that the damage caused by COVID expands beyond the nasal cavity and involves our brain region. She says the part of the brain that receives the smell signal becomes dysfunctional in the many people that report the loss of smell after a diagnosis of COVID-19 for up to six months. So of course the obvious question then is, is there anything we could do to possibly interrupt this? So we speculate that it's probably caused by inflammation. So it is possible that um, we may be able to use anti-inflammatory um, drugs as a possible uh, treatment for COVID-related smell loss. What's interesting is that in her study, severity of the virus didn't matter. We have had patients that only had mild infection but had very severe damage in the olfactory region. That means she doesn't know yet if those who are vaccinated who tend to get less severe disease are less likely to lose sense of smell. She is now working on that next study to find out if there is a lower rate of smell loss in people who are fully vaccinated. I'm medical reporter Liz Bonus. Now back to you.